Chair. I call Brendan Holland. Thank you, Mr Chair. Uh, sir, there have been six bail amendment acts in less than 10 years. Uh, the most recent in 2011. We had the Bail Amendment Act 2002, Bail Amendment Act 2003, Bail Amendment Act 2007, 2008, 2009, 2011, and now we have a bill. Sir, surely uh, we, we're better than having these knee-jerk uh, bills and legislation. So we should do it once and do it right. Sir, laws are based on anticipated consequences that are sometimes never seen. But, sir, we do see horrific crime. But judges can only go on what they are given. So we don't need more knee-jerk populist laws. What we do need is proper resourcing. These knee-jerk knee laws need to be tempered. And, sir, we've seen the police gasping for air, if you like, being under-resourced. We've got now a situation where more police than ever are leaving the order, police force. Order. This is not to do with the police. This is on bail, not the police. Thank you, sir. <coughs> I would say, sir, that this bill is funded to fail. And uh, I spoke with one of New Zealand's top barristers today, sir. And he told me of a 17-year-old girl charged with possession of a Class A drug. The police said it was a Class A... Order, order. Sir, I'm talking with uh, order. reverse... Order. What you need to focus on in this bill, in the committee stage, is on the, on the bail amendment. Nothing to do with the police. Just get back to the substance of the committee stage. Thank Peter you, Hall. sir. I'd like to say that the reverse onus of proof is wrong, sir. It's against natural justice. It's against our Bill of Human Rights. And we need to be tough on crime, sir. But equally, we need to be tough on bad legislation. And, sir, speaking on the reverse onus of proof, I can say that uh, I was told today of a case where a 17-year-old girl was charged with a Class A drug. The judge said to the police, well, why don't you just do what they do at the airports and test it? But, sir, the police don't, don't have the resources for that, so they sent it to the ESR. Now, that could have been a hold-up of over seven weeks, and a 17-year-old girl would have been in jail for seven weeks, sir. It turns out that it wasn't a Class A drug at all, it was a party drug. And this is just one example of why we should vote against this bill it is populist, it is knee-jerk, but we need good laws in this country, we need good legislation, not something that uh, is just pulled out of the pop of a hat and against natural justice. Thank you. Members, we move to the votes on uh, the committee stage. Now, while the parts and the clauses were taken as one question, I intend to put the parts and the clauses separately. So we're on part one. First, we have the Minister's Amendment. Uh, to the amendment to clause 19 is set out on SOP number uh, 339. The question is that the Minister's amendment be agreed to. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. Aye. The ayes have it. So, party votes called for. Ask the clerk for a party vote. New Zealand National. 59 in favour. New Zealand Labour. 34 opposed. Green Party. 14 votes opposed. New Zealand first. Seven in favour. Uh, could, could the member just repeat that? New Zealand first vote, please. Seven in favour. Thank you. Māori Party. Two in favour. Mana. One vote opposed. Ex New Zealand. One in favour. United Future. One in favour. Brendan Horan. One vote opposed. Point of Any order. other? Mr Chairman. I incorrectly cast the Māori Party vote. Can I correct it to yes. two opposed? Two opposed for the Māori Party. <laughs> Members, the ayes are 68, the noes are 52. The Minister's amendments are agreed to. 
we now have the Minister's amendments to part one, as set out on SOP number 339, as amended, be agreed to. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. Aye. The ayes have it. So party votes called for. Ask the clerk for a party vote. New Zealand National, 59 in favour. New Zealand Labour, 34 opposed. Green Party, 14 votes opposed. New Zealand First, 7 in favour. Māori Party, 2 opposed. Mana, 1 vote opposed. Act New Zealand, 1 in favour. United Future, 1 in favour. Brendan Horan, 1 vote opposed. Any other votes? Members, the ayes are 68, the noes are 52. The Minister's amendments, as amended, are agreed to. We move to Richard Pross's amendment to Clause 8, as set out on SOP number 334. The question is that the amendment be agreed to. Those of that in favour will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. Aye. The noes have it. Aye. So, party votes called for. I ask the clerk for a party vote. New Zealand National. 59 opposed. New Zealand Labour. 34 opposed. Green Party. 14 votes opposed. New Zealand First. 7 in favour. Māori Party. 2 opposed. Mana. 1 vote opposed. Act New Zealand. 1 opposed. United Future. 1 opposed. Brendan Horan. 1 opposed. Any other votes? Members, the ayes are seven, the noes are 113. The amendment is not agreed to. Uh, we next have Richard Pross's amendment to clause nine, as set out on SOP number 335. The question is that the amendment be agreed to. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. Aye. The noes have it. Aye. Seven. Aye. Party votes called for. Ask the clerk for a party vote. New Zealand National. 59 opposed. New Zealand Labour, 34 opposed. Green Party, 14 votes opposed. New Zealand First, 7 in favour. Māori Party, 2 opposed. Mana, 1 vote opposed. Ex New Zealand, 1 opposed. United Future, 1 opposed. Brendan Horan, 1 vote opposed. Any other votes? Members, the ayes are seven, the noes are 113, the amendment is not agreed to. The question now is that part one is amended stand part. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. Aye. The ayes have it. A party vote is called for. Ask the clerk for a party vote. New Zealand National. 59 in favour. New Zealand Labour. 34 in favour. Green Party. 14 votes opposed. New Zealand First. Seven in favour. Māori Party. Two in favour. Mana. One vote opposed. Act New Zealand. One in favour. United Future. One in favour. Brendan Horan. One vote opposed. Any other votes? Members, the ayes are 104, the noes are 16. Part 1 is amended. Will stand part. We now come to part 2. 
First, we have the Minister's amendments to part two as set out on SAP number 339. The question is that the Minister's amendments be agreed to. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. The ayes have it. Party votes called for. I'll ask the clerk for a party vote. New Zealand National. 59 in favour. New Zealand Labour. 34 opposed. Green Party. 14 opposed. New Zealand First. 7 in favour. Māori Party. 2 in favour. Mana. 1 opposed. Act New Zealand. 1 in favour. United Future. 1 in favour. Brendan Horn. One vote opposed. Any other votes? <coughs> Members, the ayes are 70, the noes are 50, the Minister's amendments are agreed to. The question now is at part two is amended stand part. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. The ayes have it. Party votes called for. I'll ask the clerk for a party vote. <coughs> New Zealand National. 59 in favour. New Zealand Labour. 34 in favour. Green Party. 14 votes opposed. New Zealand First. 7 in favour. Māori Party. 2 opposed. Mana. 1 vote opposed. Act New Zealand. One in favour. United Future. One in favour. Brendan Horan. One vote opposed. Any other votes? Members, the ayes are 102, the noes are 18, part two as amended will stand part. We now come to the clauses. The question is a clause one stand part. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. Aye. The ayes have it. So, party votes called for. Ask the clerk for a party vote. New Zealand National. 59 in favour. New Zealand Labour. Four in favour. Green Party. 14 votes opposed. New Zealand First. 7 in favour. Māori Party. 2 opposed. Mana. 1 vote opposed. Act New Zealand. 1 in favour. United Future. 1 in favour. Brendan Horan. 1 vote opposed. Any other votes? Members, the ayes are 102, the noes are 18. Clause 1 will stand part. We now come to Clause 2. We have the Minister's amendment to replace Clause 2 as set out on SOP number 339. The question is that the Minister's amendment be agreed to. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. The ayes have it. So party votes called for. Ask the clerk for a party vote. New Zealand National. 59 in favour. New Zealand Labour. 34 opposed. Green Party. 14 votes opposed. New Zealand First. 7 in favour. Māori Party. 2 opposed. Mana. 1 vote opposed. Act New Zealand. 1 in favour. United Future. 1 in favour. Brendan Horan. 1 vote opposed. Any other votes? Members, the ayes are 68, the noes are 52, the amendment is agreed to. We now have clause 3, the question is a clause 3 stand part. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. To the contrary, no. The ayes have it. Party votes called for, ask the clerk for a party vote.
New Zealand National. 59 in favour. New Zealand Labour. 34 in favour. Green Party. 14 votes in favour. Uh, opposed. New Zealand First. 7 in favour. Māori Party. 2 opposed. Mana. 1 vote opposed. Act New Zealand. 1 in favour. United Future. 1 in favour. Brenton Horan. 1 vote opposed. Any other votes? Members, the ayes are 102, the noes are 18. Clause 3 will stand part. I will report this bill with amendment. <coughs> the House is resumed, Mr Chairman. Mr Speaker, the committee has considered the Bail Amendment Bill and reports it with amendment. Mr Speaker, I move that the report be adopted. The question is that the report be adopted. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. Contrary, no. The ayes have it. This bill is set down for third reading. Fourth with Hon. Judith Collins. Mr Speaker, I move that the Bail Amendment Bill be now read a third time. This bill will make it harder for those accused of serious...